switching gears a little bit, can we talk about Cowboys and Aliens? There be a lot of buzz about that movie. John Favreau, Harrison Ford, Daniel Craig. Talk, can you tell us a little bit about the experience? Uh, it's an incredible movie. I think it's the coolest thing I've ever seen. It's amazing. It's everything you've ever wanted in a movie. Um, <laughs> it's all in one place, and I'm so excited to show that to the world. Um, I think we might blow up Comic-Con next year, but it is, uh, hi. It is, it is really, really cool and it's involving some of the most exciting people in the business and incredible effects as well as amazing uh, uh, direction and great actors that I got to hang out with. And, you know, we're cowboys and aliens. It's so great. The same movie. It's so great. Oh, cool. How was working with Fat Row? Oh my god. I mean, John's the coolest and he's someone who really embraces this kind of revolution in communication. He really takes uh, social networking very seriously. He likes crowdsourcing, being able to hear back from the fans what they think about his movies and what should happen with casting and everything else. He's very connected to the community and I feel like that's why uh, people uh, kind of feel he understands his audience and I think that's why his movies are so successful and so enjoyable. I'm sort of in my head going over all the movies you've done and actors you've worked with and I'm wondering who haven't you worked with that you're dying to? He's probably here, right? <laughs> Marty, I'd like to work with you. Oh, Marty, I'd like to work with you. Make it happen. Um, when you are not doing charity, when you're not acting, I think you have how many movies coming out in the next six months? So I don't know. A lot. Four? Yeah, a lot. I was like, ooh, I hope yeah. I get to all of them. Yeah. But when you're not doing all that, what do you like to do What might be your free time? What's free time? Yeah. <laughs> no, I, uh, gosh, I mean, I love to travel. I love to, you know, spend a lot of my free time in Haiti. I mean, that's really what I like to do when I'm not working. But um, I also like to write, and I've been working on that more and more. But um, I don't know. I try to just kick back and, and figure out what it is to be <laughs> relaxed when I can do that. What was the tipping point for you? When did you sort of know, okay, acting's not just something I watch on TV. It's what I want to do. It's my passion. Well, I, was, I mean, I think tipping points for all of us are really people that give us a shot. I think everyone here can identify somebody who believed in them at one point and, and gave them the shove that they needed. I certainly had a lot of those people in my life starting with you know, teachers when I was young and uh, uh, certainly casting directors who gave me a shot. I was an assistant. I was the worst assistant in the world. I never got one lunch order right. I never made one pot of coffee correctly. But I was an assistant for a casting director who put me in my first movie. I was a glorified extra in a movie called The Girl Next Door, which was about porn. And there's a porn convention next door. Woo! So it all comes full Coincidence? Here I am. Not. Yes, I'm back here at the porn convention. Um, so who would you consider sort of your your mentor, your your inspiration? Well, I, I'm really lucky to have uh, parents who've been really supportive of me from the beginning, and I had a mom who told me from the very moment I declared I wanted to be an actor uh, at age, you know, seven, that everyone would tell me it was impossible, every single person, and that I should ignore them, and she was right. So I'd say that's my first big fan, and still probably my biggest, so I feel really grateful for that. We love moms. Uh, all right, so what movie can we see you in next? What's next out? Oh, jeez. What month are we in? January or January? Um, I have a movie called Butter with Jennifer Garner and Hugh Jackman and a bunch of really funny, brilliant people. And that should come out hopefully uh, late spring, early summer. And then Cowboys and Aliens comes out in July. Mark your calendars. And then a movie called The Change Up that I just wrapped with um, Jason Bateman and Brian Reynolds. That is a comedy that comes out in August. And then a movie called Now, which is a sci-fi uh, kind of futuristic, dystopian, cool movie. That uh, is coming out in September. And um, that's got Justin Timberlake and Amanda Seyfried and Killian Murphy and a bunch of really cool people. As you're giving this last, do you ever have a pinch yourself moment that 
I mean, I know you've been working at a long time. This wasn't, you're not an overnight sensation, but but it's it's happening. Yeah, no, I, I've had many pinch myself moments. I think walking on stage at Comic-Con this past year, I was there with Cowboys and Aliens and Tron, and walking out on stage and being able to connect with that audience that was so excited about that material, that was a pinch me moment because I just felt so proud to be a part of, uh, I don't know, a real exciting movement in filmmaking technology, people really using their imaginations to create art and using new technology to push the boundaries of what can be created for film. Yeah. And I feel very lucky to be a part of that kind of tidal wave of exciting new technology. So it, that was a big pinch me moment. So is this. It's great. Are you on Twitter? Do you tweet? Oh yeah. I'm a tweetaholic. I overtweet. You do. You can tell when I'm bored in my trailer. I, I, I'm very um, like ebb and flow. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm either big in or yeah. big out. Oh yeah. No, I love to tweet. And I'm just uh, at Olivia Wilde. Good follow. Me. Yeah. Follow the way. Please follow me. And what if um, we have some young artists out here who want to get involved Ooh, great. in peace yeah. and justice? Ooh. Everybody can check out uh, APJnow.org and look for updates on our youth initiative, our college tour, which is launching this spring, and all the other exciting things that we're doing. Um, we will be using technology to reach you, so please key in and listen up and be a part of it, please. So live your wild, everybody. Congratulations. Thank you for being here at PDF. Thank you, Brian Gary. And everybody check out the official Facebook page of Blackberry for more.